Are we all sat comfortably? It's time for Jim Jam's Time Tunnel. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all well. And yes, it is time for another episode of Jim Jam's Time Tunnel. We're on episode five, guys. We have got one more episode to go after this one. And that is the first series of Jim Jam's Time Tunnel completed. So before I tell you what the film is I'm going to be watching today, I just want to say a massive, massive, massive thank you to everyone who commented on my last episode of Jim Jam's Time Tunnel. I am having so much fun doing this series. And the whole idea of doing this series was to show you don't need these big Hollywood blockbusters, all fancy effects, because they're all they're these hidden gems that are out there and they've been out there for many, many years and they lie undiscovered because people think, oh, it's it's a black and white film, it, it's, it's an old film, it's not going to be any good. That's clearly not the case because I have had so much fun watching these films, um, which usually I wouldn't watch so it has opened my eyes up to a new generation it's opened my eyes up to watching these classics the way they were made it's just absolutely fantastic i really really have enjoyed doing this series guys so leave them below in the comments if you do want a series two but for now i am going to tell you what i'll be watching today so i'm going to have a drum roll on my table in three two one the film I'm going to be watching today is a classic from 1938. So we're going back to the 30s again for this one. And it's a film starring Errol Flynn. And I'm going to probably butcher this name, Olivia de Havilland. And this is The Adventures of Robin Hood. Yes, we're going to Sherwood Forest today, guys. Yes, we are. The Adventures of Robin Hood. Now this has won three Academy Awards. This is like this is like a 65th anniversary edition. So it is I am looking forward to watching this. We've also got Basil Rathbone in here, we've got Claude Rains in here as well. So uh, yeah, we're going back to 1938 today, guys. So let's get Robin Hood loaded up in the Blu-ray player and let's check it out. Okay, so we have got the disc loaded up right now. So I am really looking forward to checking this one out. Okay, so I've never actually seen this version of Robin Hood before. It's one of the uh, very early versions. I have seen Disney's Robin Hood, of course, and I've also seen Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves, but never seen this one. So I'm going to sit back, guys, relax. Stay tuned to the end of the film, and I will tell you my thoughts on the adventures of Robin Hood. Go on, Robin. There he is. Go on, Robin. Oh, here we go. Whoa, tables flying. Go on, Robin. Go on, Robin. Oh, he's behind. Robin is coming behind you. Watch him. Oh, he's off. Oh my goodness, he's on the seat. What the? So he's bow and arrow out, look. Here we go. Bosh. 
took him down. Bosch took him down. Oh, what a shot. Ooh. What's he up to? Oh, he's put a... <laughs> Bless my soul, a miracle. <laughs> <laughs> Robin. <laughs> No, it's a piece of meat that does whatever Robin's eating. He's, oh, it's mutton. Oh, watch him, Robin. Hey, uh, go away, go. <laughs> oh, there's my Marion there, look. All the swords. So I have just finished watching today's pick on Jim Jam's Time Tunnel, The Adventures of Robin Hood from 1938. Now, this film, like I said earlier, guys, I've seen different re reincarnations of Robin Hood, but I've never seen this one. And I've got to say right now, Errol Flynn is a fantastic Robin Hood. I can understand why this film has won so many awards now. He's so charming, he's witty, he's very funny. Um, I thought Errol Flynn absolutely had this role spot on. And uh, yeah, every time I think of Robin Hood now, this guy here, Errol Flynn, he's, look at the, even the smile on the front cover, look. Just amazing. And we had Olivia the Havilland as Maid Marion as well. Right there. Um, yeah, I absolutely love this film. It was so much fun um, to watch. And when I was watching it, I was watching it, um, and I can't believe that this film was made in 1938. Uh, 1938 sorry, 1938. Because I was watching it. It could have been made yesterday. I just got completely lost into the story that I didn't. But we all know the story of Robin Hood. But it was nice to see this film version, which I've never seen before. And it is a Warner classic as well, which is a bonus. So, yeah, really, really thoroughly enjoyed The Adventures of Robin Hood. Now, guys, leave down below in the comments if you've seen The Adventures of Robin Hood. Do you enjoy it? And who is your favourite Robin Hood? Now, I think Errol Flynn nailed this role, to be honest. And, yeah, he, he's spot on as Robin Hood, definitely. So guys, that is about it for another episode of Jim Jam's Time Tunnel. I hope you all enjoyed the episode today, guys. Leave down below if you're enjoying the series. And uh, yeah, please hit that like button. Please share and subscribe. And I'll be back on Friday for the final episode in this series of Jim Jam's Time Tunnel. So thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day and keep smiling. See you later, guys. Bye.